It's about uh, Frank, who's like a mid-level drug dealer, uh, who gets in uh, way over his head uh, when a drug deal goes wrong and he has to basically backpedal furiously. Don't have the dope and I don't have the money. <laughs> Frank, you owe me 55000 It was a lot of turmoil that I was required. Uh, Frank goes through a hell of a lot and... Uh, that's your job as an actor. Be prepared to go out there and not be afraid to confront things and not be afraid to look ugly, not be afraid to just lose the vanity. Myself and Bronson, who plays Tony, we got on immediately. We immediately struck up a kind of older brother, younger brother kind of a relationship and that helped immensely. We had a little bit of time before the shoot started to rehearse, to play about with the scenes, just to, to hang out. We went out and hung out together a little bit just to get a get to know each other and you know get a get a rapport and a shorthand so it means that you when, when we come to filming stuff we're very comfortable i chose not to watch the original and i haven't seen the original still and i hadn't at this point because i felt that um i loved this script and i was aware of the original and it's it's cult following and and the grittiness of it but I felt that what we were doing was something different and I thought it would not help me to have Kim Bodnia's performance in my head and that the look of that and the feel of that film because we were doing something much more stylized. We were making a story about London. Luis is Spanish so it was like an outsider's eyes on London which is the thing that I fell in love with. It was a chance to shoot London in a different way through different eyes and I didn't feel that stylistically watching the original was going to help me in any way so I just decided I'm not going to watch it but I still haven't and actually because I haven't seen this yet so this is the first time I'll have seen this and um, maybe when I've watched this tonight I'll go and watch the original.